First things first, and this morning when I wake up, I just have to do my bed. This is my bed right now. And that is a cute little baby that my partner just purchased for me um, some months ago. I think it was for, for Easter time. So for me, it's very important to do my bed in the morning. And this is what I actually do right now. Um, then next thing is doing some good coffee. So uh, this is the coffee that I love, like, and it's not easy to find it. But um, let, let's prepare coffee. That's it. This is my mug. It's a cute mug over there. And let's prepare coffee. Okay, so this is practically my coffee station in my room. I have this one and I have this cute mug from Starbucks that I have purchased in October and I keep it like that. This is my favorite sort of hot chocolate and I have a couple of more mugs over there. But let's prepare coffee. It's going to become green over here and then we can just pour in the coffee in this cute mug um that i have it's a unicorn type of mug i usually have um other mugs um as you can see over there i do have quite a lot of them but i also have some others on a shelf um but let's wait for it to become uh okay Please, I need coffee. That's it. So, let's fill it up. There's nothing better than coffee in the morning. I cannot speak. I cannot reason things out before my coffee. So, I'm one of those people that don't talk to me before I have my coffee. So, this is amazing every morning um i usually take my my coffee even to the bathroom while i'm doing my makeup my hair and everything so that i can sip coffee um while i'm preparing myself and this is what i am going to do this morning so since i do have a little bit i'm going to add a little bit of water and it's getting filled up okay so coffee is here I'm going to uh, go prepare myself have a shower and everything and I'll see you later okay so this is the outfit that I have prepared for this trip I have um, a very normal pair of jeans over here I want to be comfortable I will be having a belt um, also, because I cannot wear jeans and trousers without having a belt. Then I have, this is one-handed, so bear with me. I have this top over here. Um, it has three-quarters type um, of sleeves. And this is it, basically. By the way, for those of you that might say, what's this? Um, I removed the tags from all the trousers, tops, and all my clothes. I can't stand them. This had two of them. And I know it's not that much pretty to see, but I just cut them out with scissors. Um, I can't stand these tags, these labels and stuff. So I do remove everything from my clothes. Um, so that's why this is in this state. But anyways, I think everyone... Um, does whatever makes um, him or her feel comfortable and that is one thing I always always do whenever I purchase new clothes okay so I want to show you what I have prepared to take with me um, for this day trip this is the bag that I will be taking with me it's a very spacious bag it has a lot of compartments and it can be used also as a crossbody um, which is why I purchased it because being on the go I needed a bag that um, it still can fit quite a lot of things in it that I would be needing but um, it can stay as a crossbody because I want my hands to be free 
um, I will be also having um, a luggage with me where I can store the stuff that I purchase because I'm sure I will be purchasing stuff from this um, shopping trip but um, this is a very beautiful bag they have it in different colors I bought it from Carpiza and uh, I chose the black because being on the go um, it, it will not be getting dirty and it's quite easy to clean up but they do have uh, other colors which are also very beautiful I believe they do have something like um, a sky blue one um, a gray and a beige one if I'm not mistaken but um, if you go to their website there are all the colors and all the styles um, it has a lot of compartments it has one main compartment here which is also very very spacious as you can see um, then it has two side compartments here, one over here and one over here. In this one I will be putting um, a bottle of water and um, let's start. I'll show you. Um, it also has, by the way, one main big compartment here and another zip compartment here. But um, I'm going to start from this one. As I said, it's already prepared. I just have to place my wallet and my phone in it and also my phone pouch. Um, this is my passport and it is placed into a small pouch like this, which I will be using to place all the receipts of the purchases in it. So that's there. Then I have pack of tissues um, I have this uh, this is a measuring tape I will be buying some things also for my partner so um, for clothing and I need to be sure that I am getting the right sizes because he will not be there and I took this one with me just to be able to measure um, some clothing items so that I'm sure it's okay for him um, I have this two-in-one antibacterial hand and surface wipes because it's important to be safe at these times. Um, let me see what I have. Oh, I have some sanitary towels, um, plastic bags, which if I might need them, um, I can use them. I have these, I think, have had these for years now, but um, I always just keep them there. I have another um, pack of wipes. This is an intimate pack of wipes because probably I will not be 100% okay because I'm a woman and you know what happens every month. So this is very, very important. I'm going to put it back in. So I'll show you what I have in the side pocket over here. There are a couple of snacks. This ended up a little bit not okay. I have this Nutella Be Ready and I have also this one here. So I placed a couple of... Oh, there's something else. Okay. Oh, this is just some sweets that someone gave me um, when I did a couple of purchases for Halloween. But um, I placed them here. Um, I did put a couple of snacks in here just in case because we have um, some time on the go and I might not be able to purchase anything to, to eat so I wanted to be sure. As I said this pocket is empty but it will be holding um, a bottle of water. Now let me see whether I place something over here. No, for now here there's just nothing but we'll be having some stuff over there let's go over the main compartment of this bag this is um i see it as a small bag but at the same time very very spacious and it holds a ton of stuff so this is the strap for the bag to use it as a crossbody as i said as i'm as i planned to use it this is um all the documents for us um, because I'm going with, with a friend and I might need some documents. I also have the map of the shopping complex and I have just um, listed out the shops that I want to be visiting. But I 
what else oh i have a pack of sanitary towels because as i said oh my god i have this bag here um which is i purchased it like this i purchased it from the pharmacy it is um this pocket i really like that because it's compact and it's whole it holds everything it has this Nivea hand cleanser sanitizer spray by the way this is my favorite i've carried one of these um all the time during covid and it's amazing um i also spray the handles of the carts when i go to the supermarket um and a lot of other stuff so it's very very good um i have another two pack of tissues in it and two pack of hand wipes also over there um this was like this i purchased like this from the pharmacy it's very good i really really liked it then i have a pocket in here and as you can see now it's empty um i have a pocket here and in this pocket i have placed some more sanitary towels um i have this keychain here with a log because I will be having um, a luggage with me and if uh, I have to leave it um, in the coach or somewhere else I can just secure it with with this uh, log I have quite some medicines some other sanitary towels some of these um, bandages and then i have oh as usual i have to have a notebook and the pen because if i need to jot down anything it's very important for me then i have a mask and some more woolly stuff oh i have this one which has just this in it as usual a woman thing and i have also a mirror which is this one i bought those two things together and that's it so this is the pocket i will be taking with me so this is it for what i have in my travel uh bag um there's nothing over here i will be also uh taking with me a pocket with uh, which i will be um placing it in the main luggage I will be having a pocket with a pair of pants, an extra top and some underwear in it because we're going by sea and I'm afraid that maybe something happens and if it's rough sea we will not be able to get back until the day after. So I basically just to be safe got and packed another, um, another outfit. Um, that's it. That's what I'm going to be taking with me. I hope you enjoyed this trip. I hope you uh, enjoy also this video and I hope that I have managed to show you what I have in my bag and will be managing to show you a little bit of Sicily and the shopping trip that I will be doing. Um, yeah, so that's it. That's Let's go. Let's have fun and let's see what I managed to grab this time. So we're leaving, it's 3.30 in the morning, we'll be leaving very very soon and let's see this trip, how it's going, it's going to be a day trip and we are boarding, there's a lot of trucks and stuff that are boarding, we'll be leaving at 5 and we're going to arrive around 7 I think um or even before anyways i hope this is going to be a beautiful trip i'm very excited about it
So we have arrived and there's definitely a lot of shops and I already did my first purchase but there are so many beautiful shops Crocs shop others I intend to go to Michael Kors because that's one of the main reasons why I came here Okay, so I'll show you what I've done. We are uh, practically over here and those pink are all the shops that I need to go to. So I think I did organize quite well what I wanted to do. And this is the map I have printed off the internet and marked myself. So this is the huge Christmas tree that there is in this shopping village and these are all the other uh, shops on the side. There's Ralph Lauren over there, there's Prada, there's Moschino and quite many others. That's Gucci and it's a beautiful sort of it's like a square small one and this is all the damage that I have done from Michael Kors my first purchase from Michael Kors I will show you what I have purchased later but this is uh, a travel bag this is a tote bag and I also have over there a wallet but this is what we're going to be seeing next um, my friend is in a shop and she's purchasing some stuff for others but I want to go to L'Oreal and I do have a couple of shops more to go to there's for La over there and there's Armani there so we'll have to go to a couple of more shops but the biggest damage has been done and I'm so happy of these purchases they were discounted at 20% and they gave me a further discount so quite good I think finally we're having some lunch and this is sort of I don't know it's like a closed pizza with rucola and parma ham and I've just taken some natural water and that's it that's for today for my eating Okay guys, I have just had a shower. I have returned home um, at around quarter to midnight. So just the time to have a shower and that's it. Putting on my PJs. This is the huge luggage that I had with me. It's one of the biggest ones that I have and it's completely full with stuff. And I will be just removing everything from it um, tomorrow because now I'm so, so tired. Um, it's 24 hours that I have been uh, awake and I really needed a shower. I'm going to do some tea and I'll go straight to bed. 
um, these are some more bags that I have on the sort of armchair and there's other bags over there with some mint chocolate so there's still a lot to do even this one here which is from Michael Kors is completely full of stuff and I think I also have another bag on the other chair which is also full of stuff so tomorrow there will be a lot of organization but another thing that I want to say is that there will be a video where I will be showing you whatever I have purchased from this shopping trip this was a shopping trip for me that I've done for the first time to be honest with you because I have never been to uh, Sicily's shopping village and not even to Centro Sicilia and yeah I, I have never been there actually so it was surprising to me that there were so many things that I managed to find and there were also some good deals because there was quite uh, a lot of shops that were giving us 20% off so that was great so we'll be doing another video we'll be showing you everything that I have purchased including PJs uh, some uh, Christmas decorations, chocolates, etc. So I hope that you have liked this vlog. I tried to take you with me as much as I could um, and even to show you as much as I could because it was a little bit limited um, because there were a lot of people around. They were talking about personal stuff, especially when we were traveling from one area to another with um, with the bus or coach, whatever you, you call it. And I couldn't just uh, let uh, other people's stuff uh, get in glass into. So yeah, that's, that's what basically happened. Anyways, um, hope you liked this video. Hope you liked this um, returning back with some vlogs and with some shopping. And until the next one, bye, take care.